we are going to connect LFinder file manager on the CK editor. As you can see, we don't have any browse server button here. So, after install Laravel LFinder package, we will have button here that will help us to add an image in our CK editor content. To do that, just go to Google and search for Laravel LFinder. Click on this first link. Make sure that we are on the same URL. This package is compatible with Laravel 8 and 9 which is good. We will have something like this. To install this package, just run this composer command in terminal. Add service provider to the provider's array. Run this command to publish Laravel LFinder package assets. You can publish LFinder config file using this command. Finally, run this command to publish this package views files in project resources views folder. As you can see, we have now these package views files. We are going to modify the CK editor for .blade.php file. This package uses jQuery UI that means we have to download jQuery UI. Go to Google and search for jQuery UI download. Click on this first link. To get this, just click on this stable quick downloads link. Once download finished, open zip file. and drop jQuery UI folder directly into project public directory.
Back to Visual Studio Code and update this jQuery and jQuery UI paths on this Blade file. Then change this title to your needs. I highly recommend to use CDN links on production when you go live. After that, go to CK Editor Configuration file and add the following line. By default, this package will use storage directory. Let's test. Refresh this page using Ctrl plus F5 on keyboard. As you can see, we have now browse server button here. By clicking on this button, we see this pop-up window where we have all files and folders inside project storage directory. We are going to create a unique files folder according to the logged in user instead of this default storage folder. To do that, just create new middleware that will create unique user files folder. As you can see, user unique files folder middleware has been created. Remember to import these facades files here. This number will varies according to the logged user ID. To set L finder directory use this line. This will create a unique user files folder and set that folder to default L finder directory. And then, register this middleware in kernel.php file. Let's test. Refresh this page using Ctrl plus F5 on keyboard. Good, we have now this unique folder as default L finder directory. Let's log in with other user.
As you can see, we have now this folder name. Those two folders created inside storage directory. Let's create new post to test our LFinder file manager. As you can see, we have this success message. By looking in posts table, the image included in post content. Friends, this is how you can integrate Laravel L Finder in CK Editor. See you in next video.